क्वेश्चन 161 एक्सेसिव सिक्रीशन ऑफ ओनली अल्डोस्टेरोन फ्रॉम एन एड्रिनल कॉर्टिकल ट्यूमर रिजल्ट्स इन कशिंग सिंड्रोम कॉन सिंड्रोम एडिसन्स डिजीज ग्रेव्स डिजीज द क्वेश्चन इज मेंशनिंग दैट देयर इज ओनली हाइपर सिक्रीशन ऑफ अल्डोस्टेरोन एंड इंक्रीज अल्डोस्टेरोन सिक्रीशन फ्रॉम द एड्रिनल कॉर्टेक्स से देयर इज अ ट्यूमर वुड रिजल्ट इन अल्डोस्टेरोनिज्म also known as primary aldosteronism that is corn syndrome which is option number 2 here whereas cushing syndrome is due to excessive secretion of cortisol from adrenal cortex so excess cortisol would result in cushing syndrome addison's disease option number 3 is due to deficiency of corticoids both glucocorticoids and mineralocorticoids when the cortex is destroyed or is and could be due to destruction of adrenal cortex or due to its malfunctioning and it would result in addison's disease whereas option number 4 graves disease is due to excess of thyroid hormone that is hyperthyroidism the correct answer here is option number 2 corns syndrome Question one sixty two. The cella tarsica of sphenoid bone houses X gland. Identify X, pituitary, adrenal, pineal, ovary. The cella tarsica is a saddle shaped depression present in sphenoid bone and it houses pituitary gland. So the correct answer here would be option number one, pituitary. Adrenal glands are located above both kidneys, and pineal gland is located behind third ventricle. of the brain between two cerebral hemispheres and ovaries are located in lower abdominal cavity the correct answer here is one pituitary gland question 163 complete the analogy with respect to source gland of hormone if gnrh is to hypothalamus then msh is to if we look at the correlation between gnrh and hypothalamus then we know that hypothalamus is source of gnrh so we have to find the source of msh msh that is melanocyte stimulating hormone it's a peptide hormone which stimulates the synthesis of melanin pigment and is secreted by pars intermedia of pituitary gland so the right answer here would be option number 2 that is pars intermedia whereas zona fasciculata and zona reticularis are layers of adrenal cortex and neurohypophysis is posterior pituitary correct answer is option number 2 question 164 the hormone which stimulates secretion of water and bicarbonate ions from pancreas is gastrin secretin cholecystokinin gip that is gastric inhibitory peptide when the acidic chyme enters the small intestine the acidic chyme or the acid in the small intestine would result in the secretion of secretin and this secretin would stimulate pancreas to secrete water and bicarbonate ions and these bicarbonate ions would provide the alkaline medium which is essential for the functioning of the upcoming enzymal activity Thus, the right answer here would be secretin. That is option number two. Let's look at the other options. Option one, gastrin. This would stimulate the release of gastric juice for digestion. Cholecystokinin would act on both pancreas and gallbladder to release pancreatic juice and contract the gallbladder to release bile. Whereas GIP, that is gastric inhibitory peptide. this hormone would inhibit the gastric motility and its secretions the right answer is option number 2 secretin question 165 a patient of diabetes mellitus will excrete glucose in urine 
even when kept on a carbohydrate free diet because amino acids are discharged in blood stream from kidney glycogen synthesis increases fats are catabolized to form glucose gluconeogenesis is inhibited the case presented here is of a patient of diabetes mellitus who is excreting glucose in urine and is on a carbohydrate free diet let's try to understand the case a patient of diabetes mellitus would suffer from deficiency of insulin and when there is insulin deficiency there would be lack of cellular uptake of glucose which means the body cells would starve because of lack of glucose and when glucose is not available for energy they will initiate the breakdown of fats for energy and this breakdown of fats is for the generation of glucose the glucose that is detected in the urine is due to breakdown of fat because fats are catabolized to form glucose the correct answer here would be option number 3 fats are catabolized to form glucose let's look at option number 1 amino acids are discharged in blood stream from kidney that's incorrect and not related option number 2 glycogen synthesis increases this is the storage form of glucose and is incorrect option number 4 gluconeogenesis is inhibited that is incorrect because glucose is going to get generated here the correct answer here is option number 3